What's up, everyone? Hey, guys. We are no longer in Arkansas. Mm -hmm. We are at Fort Pickens Campground in Pensacola Beach, Florida. Yay! We're so happy to be here. Oh, yeah. We've had a long day of travel, so we both look like hoodlums, but we're yeah. very excited to be here. It's yeah. beautiful. I'm exhausted. I'm, I haven't gotten any sleep. <laughs> but we are so pumped to be here. Mm -hmm. And this is going to be more of a relaxing, more it's pretty much hang out every day all day at the beach mm -hmm. because in New Mexico and like Taos and all that we were like go yeah, go, 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 go 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 and we did Schedule so much was stuff packed. yeah and but it was well Very worth active. it so good oh yeah just different trips is all we're saying exactly yeah, yeah. we're excited to so, just rest yeah it's going to be a nice relaxing time but we're mm -hmm. so glad to be here and this yes. is like pristine weather oh, here it's right so now. beautiful yeah I had no like I had no idea what it was going to be like yeah, in the either. fall in October. I've always gone, you know, just like in the, the summer, yeah. like peak season, but yeah. like it's so beautiful. Yeah. It's I like, mean, like, this is yeah. really magical. And like it, during the day, it's warm. It's like 80 something degrees, mm -hmm. but there's a breeze. And right so now it's probably like mid 70s. Yeah. Know. Oh, it feels nice. Oh, it's so nice. Oh, gosh. And we're going to go to the beach after supper. And talking oh. about supper, we oh. are going to do something really cool tonight. We're going to do pan seared ahi tuna oh, man. um i think the variety is yellow fin i think yeah and then we're gonna do some lime cilantro basmati rice as well and just keep it simple and we're yeah. really really excited about that oh yeah yeah and Thanks. i've never cooked ahi tuna like pan either. seared tuna so mm -hmm. this is totally new yeah first time yeah first time callers long time listeners long time listeners yeah <laughs> so here's our campsite it is uh we're in if you've ever been to fort pickens or you plan to come here we're in D area, which is like tent camping only, and it's one vehicle per campsite, and I believe like only one tent or maybe two tents per campsite. But they're kind of small campsites, but they are spaced out pretty nice. Mm -hmm. So here's our site. This is D18, and it's not bad. What's it called? The Gulf is to our left, and then the ocean is to our right. So we're like on this little, I don't know, kind of peninsula. Yeah, and that's the, the bay. Mm -hmm. yeah. The bay, not yeah, the gulf. The bay. The, bay. the bay, and then like the <laughs> gulf or the ocean uh -huh. over there. Yeah. But super nice. We have the tent set up right here. I believe someone's checking in there later, and then the next campsite later today. We do have some neighbors. There's our picnic table, our kitchen set up. And we do have like a nice little grove of trees right there and bushes to help like privacy and all that because there are campsites just right along the back of this right here so it is a tight campground but i mean for the most part you're here for the beach so mm -hmm. we're excited and we are starving mm -hmm. and we're so hungry and looking forward to <laughs> mm -hmm. to this dinner yes so let's get started on ahi tuna what are we doing first so foist off and foist most we're doing water in our pan so that we can boil the basmati. And we got everything at the store except for propane. So we're running on like a half tank of propane here. So we're gonna bring that to a bowl, put the rice in, mm -hmm. and in the meantime, we are going to... Um, Get started on a marinade. Yeah, a marinade. Yeah. I was gonna say soak, but yeah, it's yeah, a marinade. Either way. Yeah, for the tuna. So right now we're starting with low sodium soy sauce. I'm just gonna kind of wing it. This is just to give it a good flavor. Fresh black pepper. And garlic powder, of course. What's a marinade without some garlic? I'm gonna do some thyme, just a little. I really want the flavors of the tuna to you know, come out. And now time for the best part, the tuna. And we went to a local fish market in Pensacola. Yeah, that was cool. And we have fish, fresh tuna, and lots of other fish because we're eating, we're going to be all fished out once we leave here. So we're eating fish for just about every meal. is a guesstimate. Well, we're trying to get filled up on tuna. Maybe not so much basmati, so. Yeah. We don't measure around here. We just, uh, don't measure unless eyeball. you really, really have to. 
All right, the rice is done. Al dente. All nice and fluffy. Al dente, that's not right. That's, <laughs> that's like a new. That's like Italian. <laughs> that's We're okay. not even doing Italian. It's oh. soft, it's fluffy. Put it that way. Now, time for the ahi tuna. So, what are we doing next, Erica? Now, I'm getting the cast iron super stinking hot. Um, so that the tuna can be seared. And so what I'll do, which I can go ahead and do now, we have a tri-colored sesame seeds. I'm just gonna put that on the plate like so. What's happening here? Oh, the table's mm -hmm. not even She warped. We've got all the tables, what do you do? I'm just gonna go, I just go to the plate with the sesame while the uh, pan is heating up. And then, after this kind of gets good and warm, which we're almost there, I'm going to take the tuna out of the marinade and I'm going to dip the sides. Actually, no. I'm going to dip the entire thing in the sesame seed and lay it on the pan. And you have to be really mindful of how long you keep the tuna steak on the pan. So it's only supposed to do like 30 seconds to one minute on both sides. Because um, we're trying to get that, you know, very, really, really rare tuna steak for sure. Yeah, because if you overcook it, it becomes very tough and you lose a lot of the flavor. And this is just to give it that nice crunchy outer layer. All right, I have the timer going for 30 seconds. And wow, that goes so fast. We're already at 10 seconds, my goodness. We are squeezing lime onto the basmati now, and then I'll do, I've already chopped the cilantro. Oops, I'm, I'm sick. Wow, it looks so pretty. That, that is pretty much all sides. I'm gonna take her, cut her into it. Oh, she's beautiful, oh my goodness. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Dinner was so good. It was so good. Wow. It was so good. I was I'm impressed. Mm -hmm. That was delicious. And the, the soy sauce that we put on it and the sesame seeds. I feel like that made it. Mm. Like the, the fish yeah, alone the tuna is... tuna is a really mild tasting fish, I feel like. Yeah. So it's pretty mild, but it's so good. That was one of the best meals I've had. lime rice turned out as well. Yeah. It was good. Honestly, I could have just eaten the tuna by mm -hmm. itself. Like I could have done without the rice. So now we're going to go take a walk on the beach and check it out. It is like a half moon or crescent moon. So we can still see a little bit with the white sand and everything, but... Y'all will not be able to see anything, so we're gonna go ahead and call it a night with y'all. We'll see you in the morning. See you guys. What a crap! <laughs> look at that, look at the little fella! He's so cute! Wait, hold him still now, let's see. Man, he looks like he's death wearing. I feel like his little heart, dude. Look at the little hairs wow. on his legs. See that? Yeah, I do. Wow. Oh! Oh! I'm sorry! Good morning, everyone. Morning. We had such good rest. Yeah, night. we slept so hard. Oh my gosh. And it actually cooled off a lot. Mm -hmm. Like it, it was a little warm in the tent when we first got in. It. Yeah, it's just so humid here, which yeah. that's fine. We're, we're pretty used to that in Arkansas. Yeah, I think I didn't even change position sleeping until yeah. like 5 a.m., which is pretty rare for me. We have had a peaceful morning, mm -hmm. and Erica has actually cooked breakfast this morning. I was busy editing the vlog that will be out tomorrow, which it was actually like last Sunday. So that's what I've been doing, but she cooked a delicious breakfast. She did chorizo, burritos with egg, cilantro, and avocado. avocado. Chorizo and egg, yeah, yeah, yeah. They are delicious. But we're gonna clean up 
our kitchen here, kind of pick up our campsite, and it's gonna be a beach day. Mm -hmm. We're gonna hang out on the beach, hanging out in paradise. <laughs> and uh, but we gotta go get ice, and then we'll see you on the beach. This is amazing. And we've actually been out here so long that the tide has risen and it's up to where our canopy is now. I mean, look at this. Look, it almost swept that away. Earlier, when we were here, where the waves ended was about like right here. Which is a ways from where we are set up now. And look at that. It's like washing almost getting up to, it's getting up to the chair that's crazy and it has been the most relaxing day and like we said in the beginning this trip is all about relaxing we're here to enjoy the beach we're gonna have a whole lot planned besides dinner tonight we are going out to dinner and we're excited because Pensacola is one of our favorite places and if y'all are enjoying the content, be sure to like, share, and subscribe on this video. And stay tuned because there will be a part two coming out of this. All right guys, we're starting to pack up and Jonathan just went on a long walk. Show us what you got. Check out these shells I just found. Look at that. I mean, that's like yeah, that's the size crazy. of my head. <laughs> Look at that. Let's see. That's the same. I know it's broken up, but that is crazy. Wow. Man. Imagine that like a whole Yeah, the size scale of that. that my that's gosh. Insane. And look at that. So has a hole in it. That is insane. Jonathan, look at me. And three quarters of a sand dollar. Or half. Oh my goodness. That's pretty impressive, I think, for a find on the shore. Yeah, it's so beautiful. I found looks like those are like oyster shells maybe then a few others this one's pretty thick Ooh, like that's heavy. beautiful super pretty another half of a sand dollar this one's also part of i think like pink species like pretty mm. thick and heavy and then this guy super pretty nice. beautiful 
good finds. I am all showered up. So it's Erica. I'm still waiting on her. But this campground right now is so peaceful and so beautiful. Look at the evening sky right now. And the temperature's nice. I'm not sweating. It's not hot. This is perfect. We are going out to eat tonight. And I don't think we've made up our mind where we're going yet. We have an idea, but I don't think we know just yet. I mean, we're at a wine bar, and they have like a huge selection of wine. I had to get them all back. We're red cans. A 2018 sure. Malbec. Like I mean, flavorful reds. As well oh my gosh, out. full bodied Malbec. Oh, it's hard to concentrate right now. There's so much going on. Around yeah, us. there's like, I mean, I don't look, know if y'all can see real like quick. the whole. Yeah, look at real quick. Yeah. Look at that. Right it's now. Pumping. I hope y'all enjoyed this video and remember keep, keep it, it wild. wild.